What's up guys? Back again, Baba is you. Timer started the second the episode started. Let's go. We made a lot of progress in the last one. We're inside the flaming hot. Where are we? The volcanic cavern. Cleared some rooms, got our brains broken by number three. Let's go ahead and head on to five and see if we can't make the push. Torn apart. Cliffs stop ya. Texts float. Flags win. Babas are groups. And groups are you? Baba is sink. Hey! What is a group though? What in the world is a group? What if we're no longer a group? Ha! Huh? Baba is group though? Baba is Groot? So now we have access to groups. Group is push. I don't... Text is gonna float over this here. Lava? Oh, we have a rock over there. How about rock is group? I don't know what that means, to be honest. Um, I don't know what, why you, what? Why is my brain broken? Get down there, Rock. I don't know what the meaning of group is in that thing other than just to be a word. If they were trying to teach me something, it didn't sink in. Let's just be clear about that. But we're gonna go into here and we're gonna look at vital ingredients. Oh goodness, okay, they, they, they wanted us to have learned something about group. What do we have here? We have flags being win. We need to unlock the doors. And we need to get things across the belt. Belt is probably always gonna be all these rules on the outside, probably not changing. So what are those rules? Baba, he's you. Skulls are skulls, so we can't make the skulls anything else. Bats are bats, we can't make bats anything else. And belts will shift. We don't have access to a belt in here for, for that to matter. So we need to open things. We can make the skull push, but it won't matter. Do we need to make the skull into a group? The bat into a group? I don't know what group does! Ah! I mean, we can get our, our creatures up there if we want. We can get our bat friend up there. And then we can get our skull friend up there. Without losing any words, we can get our, our things up there. Ah, we trapped ourselves! We played ourselves, y'all. So we got our skulls and our bats up there. What did that do? So what if we make bats into groups and skulls into groups? We have enough is's to maybe make that happen. We need to make the groups open. So if we make bats and skulls into groups, and we make them open and we make groups push, we can push them as one unit and open the doors. So we need to jumble all of this text into a horrible automation that will then allow us to do things the way we want them to be done. Right? Like, we're going to have to make a horrible amalgamation of text to make that happen. So we need to have groups be push. We need to have skulls be groups. 
we need to have, hold on, get, get the bat out of the way for the moment so that it's not in our amalgamation. So groups are push, skulls are groups. So we need bats to be groups. And then we make uh, skull as group is open. So now, whoops. Group is open. So now if we went across here, they are both a part of group, and they both should open things. Okay, so group's starting to make more sense. It allows us to break up elements and make them both into one thing, essentially. It's probably more complicated than that, I would imagine. But that's what my brain wants me to think. Let's go check out eight, the heist. Law rules, Baba is you, love is when. So we would somehow need to teleport. Fire and flag are defeat. What's the relevant, so, if, oh, we can make text into flags and then flag would be win and we'd win. But no flag isn't even win, so I don't know why flag being defeat is relevant. We'll see though. Flag on fire is push. So we would need to somehow push a flag, but flags don't float. And they would be defeat anyway. Ice is teleport. In case that weren't clear. Walls are stop, lava is stop and shut. There's a lot of elements that aren't even on the screen that have rules, which immediately upsets my brain a great deal. This look, you're gonna be like, hey, you didn't even try. No, I, I, my brain's not ready for that one. I'm gonna be honest with you. Let's go to join the crew. It's also the last one of a little segment, which makes me think it's like the hardest in the segment. And maybe the other ones are just gonna try to teach us things to an extent. We have more groups. Baba is a group. We can make rocks into me, which will then allow us to do this. We can then extract the word bat. What's that going to do for me? <sighs> Instead of Baba being a group, we can make Baba into bats. That then, um, no, that wouldn't make any sense. Because rock is you. Baba is a ra, or Baba being a bat wouldn't help at all. And bats are bats anyway, so we can't change the bats, and they're defeat if we walk into them. So if we even became them, we would lose, right? Baba is Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on the horses. We make The rocks aren't uh, what? Oh, but of course, we need to stay in control of the rocks for a little while. We would need to make... Okay, hold on. Baba is the group, and the group is you. Now the bats are the group, and they die, but Baba doesn't, because we control them all. Congratulations. Boom. You see what I'm saying about level eight, though? It's like the last one in the area. Which makes me think like each little segment is like a teaching tool, right? And then they get harder within the section. So 14 is kind of like a standalone that seems like it's going to be very difficult. And 2 through 8 here have their own little teaching mechanic. And they can progressively get harder until you can escape. 
so on and so forth. We were able to clear five, six, and nine. They have a very interesting way of setting up levels, and I think it's very cool. Automation. Let's check it out. Once again, this is going to be the hardest of the area. And immediately, I'm flooded by rules. Maybe that's not a bad thing. What are you guys, by the way? I saw you before. Statues, you're statues. <sighs> I should have read that one before we did anything. Cliffs are stop. Boxes are boxes. Me is me. So what they're trying to do to me here is tell me, you can't change a whole lot of rules. Me is me, Texas float. Baba is Baba. Baba is you. Ice is defeat. Ice has a flag. Flag is win. Group is group. Huh. The group thing, like, you gotta create, like, these weird monstrosities to make the groups work. And it's very mind flooding. Baba is You isn't gonna move anywhere. I don't think. All right, yeah, this is another this is another brain breaker. We're gonna back out of this one. We're gonna go over to the new section. We only need to clear two more levels. If we can clear two levels over here without exploding our brain, then all is well. Baba is you. Do we have any new elements here? Ghost facing. We saw this before. Ghost facing a wall is pushed. So right now we can push him, and then he'll no longer be pushable because he's not facing a wall anymore. Well, what we should do is make it to where he's pushed when he's not facing a wall, right? We didn't have to push him in the first place unless we move him now. So get him off whenever he's not facing a wall. Ghost is not facing a wall, he's push. So now we can push him freely. We need keys to be pushed, but how do we get the ghost out there? That's a great question. We could push him all the way into there. But why is it relevant that we even have him? I don't know. We can make keys push. Can we get out there? Is that the problem? <sighs> That's the problem. Is once we're here, we trap ourselves. Why does that matter, though? Uh, what if we just did flag as man? Well, no, that isn't. Where's the flag? Ghost has the flag? push. Let's complete the rule set. Alright, ghost. Let's go! Well, we got myself and the ghost through. Do I care, though? Tyler's flag is win? The ghost has the flag. 
What do we do with the ghost? How do we make the ghost go away? The ghost is shut. Key is open. So we push the ghost out. Oh, but he's but he's facing a but he's facing a wall. Though. And then we can push the key into him and make him into a flag and win. We just needed to get the ghost through. That was easier. The ending was easier than I made it look. What do we got? Trapped. We need to clear one more level to clear the area. Let's check out Trapped. See what it has in store for us, shall we? We can make flag as win. <sighs> when we face a wall, we die, huh? No, we become empty, which is essentially the same thing. Oh my, so we can't boxes or teleport if you if you didn't pick up on that. Okay. Flag's not win. Somehow stop the belt from shifting. We can make our way over here, but it doesn't change much. We can escape it as well as we don't have to face a wall to be there. We can't interact with the rules down there messing up our brains though. Not come out of the box in some other fashion, right? Like, so where it it makes me think we can get onto the wall. Like we had this scenario on that one bonus level where we had to like finagle our way onto a wall. We can't move any other direction but up or back left here without killing ourselves. We can get up here. We can get onto this wall, but that won't do anything. And it'll kill us if we go that way. It'll kill us if we go that way. Any way but up is lethal again. Interesting. So how do we get onto the wall here without... We can stop the belt from being shift. Which then means we can teleport back get here. We can get onto this wall, which does nothing, and then we can get onto this wall, but we can't get any farther. How very complicated this is. <laughs> so because of the belt not being shift, what does that actually give us? I don't... I don't know. <laughs> telly but it won't go anywhere anywho 
about this belt anyway, and where would it take us? It wouldn't take us anywhere. But what if... Baba being Telly does nothing. What if belts were boxes? What if... How do we get the box? <laughs> how do we... Box! Box, how do I help you? How do I help you help me? Are you trapped there? Or did I just put you there? I just put you there. We can still save you. The thing about Bob is that he's a... He's a box that doesn't do nothing. What was I trying to do? I was trying to turn belts into Baba? No, belts into boxes. No, because belts are that, and they, they're an immutable rule. Ah! I don't know, okay? I don't know of a way to get onto that wall and then get to something to break it. You know what I'm saying? We need to somehow break through the walls. Restart the level. Let's look at it with a fresh set of eyes. We need to get up there somehow. If we come at this from the right, no, it doesn't matter. But we can't. We can't. If we can somehow get to the edge of the wall here without killing ourselves, that would be optimal. We don't have anything we can't already access by turning the belt off. Turning the belt off does nothing. I think, anyway. If we made... Whoops. We made boxes telly up here? We can't move the box, though. There's no easy way to get out. Escape! Alright, we're gonna exit this one because I, I can't. But what can we really do? 3, 8, and 10 all broke our brains. We only need one more clear. Or what about the extra level, even? I mean, we'll even try the extra level. Let's try that, huh? Coronation. There's not a lot to interact with. This can't be that hard. What is what if we... Hey -ya! Rockets push. It won't defeat us then. What if we swap it? Text this swap. But we would need push to no longer be the, the thing, right? Let's make rock not be pushed first. Well, now let's make rock be push. Text is always push. I don't know why that's even there. So let's make this be over here. Let's disable that. Let's put this on top of it. And now let's do... What? 
Ja. Oh, what? Let's do a cool restart on that one. So, do that. What else can we win? Text can be win. Why couldn't text be win? Oh, because text is win. Lava is rock is defeat. Text is not push though. Push it when we do this. What? Huh? Uh, does that count? Let that count. Okay, I'm. I don't. I don't know, friends. We have nine flowers. We've unlocked an ice level. Get me out. The mountain top. We're making incredible progress. We can even we can even look at it. We need six clears. That's most of this area, and that frightens me more than you could ever imagine. Listen to the music, dude. It's gonna be so good. Oh. Oh, it's actually terrifying. Oh my, it's actually horrifying. Lonely? Oh golly. Oh golly gee. Never mind, it's beautiful again. It's so very subtle. You hear this? How could you ever say this does not have the greatest music you've ever heard? Um, we can make lonely skull. What does lonely do though? Does lonely skull just want attention? He's not alone, therefore he's not defeat. He has other skull friends with him, right? So he won't kill us anymore, because he's... He's got friends, so he's not angry enough to kill us, I think is the implication there. I think... We've unlocked levels 2 and 3. Love at first sight. Birdies. Flag is win. Birds are, are push. Lonely birds. So when birds are alone, they're you. Love on bird is you. Wall is... Why does the cobblestone kill us? So this seems old school, that we can get the birds to where one of them is outside? Oh, 
What if the birds are not pushed? Can we cross on them? Oh my goodness. Okay. What does the ice do? The ice still kills us, but we have the birds now as a bridge. We can push text back across and say, like... Can we do, like, bird is flag? Or something? Or flag is bird? No, flag being a bird wouldn't help. Yeah, no, maybe it would. Come on. Flag? It's a bird. Well, no, but we still can't cross, though, right? I, I was thinking we'd use the text as a bridge like we did with the birds, but... We got the stuff out. Whoops. Oh no, we can still get that out. Let's remake Bird as Bush and see where that gets us. We could then... We could extract a bird. But we can't extract both birds. We can use the bird, we can use a bird to set this up better. We sacrifice a bird. If we do it like this, we can say bird is win. But we can't do bird is push or else that'll be awkward for us. Bird is win? And then we can walk on him? Yes! Two levels down. Level three. Solitude. It'd be kind of cool if the overhead for the areas had music too, but it makes sense. It's so ominous at the start. We're a bird! We're also pink, like a baba. Wall is stop. Lonely key is open. So when keys are lonely, they open things. Box has a flag in it. So we need to destroy the box. The box is shut and he's push. The fact that he's push makes me think we need to get in there, get him out, push a key into him, open him, he has a flag, we win. Booyah. Skulls are defeat. Why why is it relevant that we can't go up there? I mean we still can. So what's the relevance there? That probably means we need to get text in there somehow. Did we make it to where the rock kills the skull? What does the rock do? The rock does oh he's just push. We could push the rock into here. But now the rock blocks our path. But if the rock isn't pushed, we can still navigate around him. We can make the key push. We don't want to isolate text though, so push it that way. Keys can be pushed. We could even push the key on top of the rock. Now they occupy the same space. Perhaps the rock can save the key? The key won't die from the water though, right? The water sinks, but it won't sink them both, and it'll probably only sink the top thing, which would be the rock. I think this is how we transport them. Now the skull becomes relevant, because we've got to get around him somehow so that we can then push from up there. So... We need to push things into there. Like what, though? Lone... Only... 
Hey, save this boy. So what if we did lonely key? We need key is push, I think, to just be a thing. Oh, there goes our timer. Dismiss, please. Okay, so this level will be the last thing we do. If we can even manage it. Lonely keys are push. We got lonely up there. We still maintain the fact that keys are push. We can then say... It's not lonely because it has a rock with it. Okay, so it doesn't have to even be its own kind. If we push lonely, key will then be push? Do we need the key? Um... Hold on. Rock is open, perhaps? Oh, I think we... <laughs> Whoops, hold on. Leave the box alone. But wait. Oh, now we can just push the box onto it. Yeah! Look at this dope progress. I don't even know how much game is left at this point. I have no idea. We've cleared most of the areas. We haven't full cleared really like any of them. But don't hate on my accomplishment at the lake, okay? Maybe our greatest achievement we ever make. But anyway, that'll do it for this episode. What did we do in this one, you ask me? Well, we finished clearing the chasm. No, wait. Was that this episode? Not even the last one. Either way, we got through what was left of the volcanic cavern, and it really it took us down to the bitter end. We may have had to, like, do some turbo cheating to get past if we hadn't figured it out at the last possible chance. Of well, we still never attempted 14. Maybe we could have made that one work. But we cleared the volcanic cavern. We made it to the mountaintop where we then completed its first three levels. We now find ourselves three levels away from clearing the mountaintop. What awaits us after that? I don't know. But that'll be for the next episode, and I will see you all in it. And until then, thank you for watching, and bye-bye.